Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. India's premier defense research institute DRDO has gained significant know-how from the Rustam program and its learning has been implemented into various other programs such as Tapas, Archer, Archer NG and even Swift. The technology being developed for these UAVs will drive the development of FUFA or futuristic unmanned fighter aircraft. As per DRDO, the Stealth Wing Flying Test Bed or SWIFT is an indigenously developed system with an objective of bridging technology gaps towards the design and development of an indigenous FUFA or futuristic unmanned fighter aircraft. This technology is the lead in for national goal to develop the FUFA aircrafts. SWIFT is also a scaled down version of Ghatak, which is going to be a much bigger UCAV. SWIFT is being developed to prove some of the critical technologies such as unmanned, stealth, and high speed autonomous landing and takeoff. SWIFT uses indigenous systems for its navigation, guidance, and control, indigenous flight control computer, and all other avionic system. The control law and software for this SWIFT has been developed and tested in-house by DRDO. As a unique capability demonstrator, the UAV features autonomous landing without need for ground radars, infrastructure or pilot. This allows UAV to take off and land from any runway with surveyed coordinates. This has been achieved with the help of onboard sensor data fusion with indigenous satellite-based navigation system using Gagan receivers to improve the accuracy and the integrity of GPS navigation. The SWIFT design features arrow head wing with tailless configuration. The UV's structure is made up of lightweight carbon pre-preg composite material developed indigenously. The composite structure is impregnated with fiber interrogators for health monitoring. The UAV has all up weight of 1100 kg, wingspan of 5 meters, and has length of 4 meters. It will have a range of 250 km in line of sight. The UAV has service ceiling of 6 km with endurance of 1 hour. At present, Swift is powered by Russian NPO Saturn 36MT turbofan engine. The plan is to replace it by Manic engine at later stage. The UAV has a cruising speed of 0.6 Mach with two hard points each capable of carrying 50 kg of payload. Swift can auto take off and land at a speed of 70 meters per second. On 1st July 2022, Swift took its maiden flight at Aeronautical Test Range ATR in Chitradurga, Karnataka proving its automatic takeoff and landing capabilities. On 15th December 2023, DRDU has successfully demonstrated another flight trial of SWIFT from ATR Chitradurga in Karnataka. The two noticeable features in the present test were that the UAV was flying without vertical stabilizer and we could also see the stealth nozzle of the engine. The landing and takeoff speed of UAV in the recent trial has been very close to its final configuration, which means that development has reached in very advanced stage. As of now, seven flight trials in various development configuration of two SWIFT UAV prototype has been conducted. These flight tests led to achievements in development of robust aerodynamic and control systems, integrated real-time and hardware in-loop simulation, and state-of-art ground control station. The team of DRDO has optimized the avionic systems, integration and flight operation towards the successful 7th flight trial in the final configuration. There were many critical technologies which has been proven during the recent trial. However, due to the sensitivity of the project, much of the information has not been revealed in the public domain. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, 
Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.